Hello YouTube, you crazy people out there. Well, we're out for another adventure. I've got to say, it's a little bit bloody windy. And uh, I reckon another mile and we'll be done. And we're going to stop and have a chat. Come back. YouTubers or you crazy people out there I hope you're all staying safe thank you very much for clicking on this video well I'm out on my own today um, did a bit of solo kayaking just wanted to see what it'd be like uh, with just myself the big tandem see how it handled this is windy as hell we've uh, got blown uh, for every paddle full we're actually getting blown back two at one point so uh, pulled up for a bit of a breathe now it's a the refuge at the side of canal bridge out the wind which is quite nice so yeah little man's out look he's shivering he's in my jacket he's like when's summer coming oh, i ain't into this winter stuff dad but, <laughs> he was the one barking at me to take him hey what do you reckon yeah right. Right, no. so yeah he come out his daughter aggie um as you can see um she absolutely loved it and uh, she wanted to come today, but it's like he's he's out of the two of them is out of work. So uh, here we are, we're out for a paddle. We're going to announce the 100 subscriber giveaway. Um, 121 subscribers. Wow, <laughs> thank you very much to every single one of you. Um, I thought if I got two, I might be doing well, you know. Um, just glad you're not coming along for another adventure. So I go back to work Monday. Which is going to be very right like um, Part of the kayaking was to get myself fit, or bike fit, uh, for work. Because obviously I, uh, I've got a shoulder injury. And the kayaking has really worked. Best physio I could have done. And uh, I've pretty much got every bit of strength back in there now. So back on a bike Monday, which I'm looking forward to. My daughter's gone back to school this week and uh, going out on the kayak really did um, boost her confidence in herself and in life. It was quite amazing, you know. She went from being that uh, shy reserved girl in the morning that was like, no, nah, no, nah, I ain't coming, I ain't getting up. No, thank you, I'll stay here. And uh, I said to her what I said to her when um, she came on a biking holiday um, a few years ago now she was 10 so five years ago and I wanted to take her on the back of my motorcycle around France visit some places um, for two weeks and she was like oh no 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 I'm not sure if I can and she was quite a confident little bubbly girl at this and I said to her look try it once uh, just round the block come round the block try it once get your kid up and if you don't like it and you say I never ever want to do that again then you don't have to, because you've tried. And as I say to all my kids, it's all about trying. As long as you try. And if then you decide that after trying it's not for you, then it's not for you, then you know. So, as a little girl, took her around the block, and uh, there was a lot of lot of nerves, and oh, I don't want to get on, I don't want to get on, but eventually got her on, took her around the block, and pulled up, and she was like a Cheshire cat, and she says, when can we go again? And that, for that weekend we took her to uh, Skag Vegas on the back, um, which was a really long day for her and we started doing that um, regularly um, every other week a um, bit of training you know getting her into getting a bike fit and we took her on a two and a half thousand mile um, journey around France and what an amazing trip that was for a ten year old girl on the back of the motorcycle and for us and for me as a dad you know um, it's it's to spend time and have memories with your kids is one of the best things you can do because they grow up so quick um, so with the kayaking I got her on there and you know as you can see from this footage um, we had a really good day and so she was buzzing she was bubbly and um, as soon as we'd finished the day she was asking when the next day would be and for me that was you know that was mission complete that's that's what I wanted I wanted to bring her out of that bedroom that bedroom doom and gloom 
it worked. Um, so she got back to school this week, um, which is an eye opener. I dropped her off this morning, and there's 40 kids stood outside them gates. And they're cuddling and high fiving. Um, but the kids, you know, we've expected far too much of them up to this point, and we just need to let them be kids. I mean, hey, as a dad, I've got two lads. Um, both grown up now. She's got two brothers, and then the only child we've got left as such is, is Lila Jane. And uh, so she's 15 now, going on 20, because uh, they grow up so quick. And um, I think if anything good's come out of this COVID for me as a parent, it's, especially as a, as a father to a daughter, it's uh, COVID is eight. Social distancing, boys aren't allowed within two metres of her. See, with your lads, it's easy about one prick but with your daughter there's absolutely thousands thousands to worry about so you know um, I'm just glad to see the smile back on her face and some sort of normality uh, back in her life um, so yeah it makes it all worth it um, and, and that's why for me the kayak was a really good buy um, the same with my wife you know we got into a, a stoop where we just felt locked down can't get out on the motorbikes um, and then the kayak sort of came together and we haven't looked back. All we've done is come out and laugh, just laugh. So we were out the other day and um, we did do a little bit of filming. And yet again, I got back, there was no audio to some of it. I'm having audio issues at the minute. And uh, we, we sat down and cupped here and announced um, the under subscribers giveaway. Stop messing. <laughs> what do you mean stop messing? All right, are you ready? <laughs> what are you doing? There's nothing there. <laughs> strange dog. He's a strange dog. What is he? Strange dog. He's a strange dog. Got issues. <laughs> He's got more than issues. And <laughs> 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 yeah, huh? Oh, he's got his life jacket on. Bless him. He's cold to <laughs> die. Just like the wife. The watch. Mummy's cold to die. Anyway, anyway, hello YouTube, you crazy people. Uh, we've come out for another paddle today, and uh, it's freezing. Isn't it? Freezing cold. It's freezing, but it's nice to be out. Fresh um, air, birds. It's more today the video in to give um, the results for the 100 subscriber which I still feel quite surreal really there's uh, over 100 crazy people out there like watching us crazy people do crazy stuff that ain't You're really crazy, crazy. <laughs> so I had a few comments and to be fair quite a few of them made me laugh but I decided that I was going to award the 100 subscriber giveaway gift to the primitive one um, pretty much because I watched his channel very early on and he did the same to me and we sort of followed each other but he gave me the inspiration to actually get a kayak and just have a go at it and uh, this was last year and uh, he's pretty much followed me all the way into this year and he's gave me a lot of support and, um, and advice when I've asked for it so uh, yeah it's the primitive one I shall be sending you your little gift gift pack out. Um, just uh, send me a message on Instagram, and uh, we'll get it posted out to you, won't we? Congratulations! Congratulations! Cold. <laughs> it's been crashed and burned. Oh, you grounded us. Yeah, cool. How rude! <laughs> Who's going to strike? <laughs> Not gone on strike. I haven't.
Come on, girl, you're doing well. Good job, we got a plastic one. Get out and have some adventures rather than being stuck at home, which is what this kayak's given me. It's given me the ability just to, for the day, just to have an adventure as well as exercise. So I, I'd say to anybody, you know, if you've never done it and you want to go, get another go. If you watched the, um, the, the maiden voyage uh, video, myself and my wife, um, even now, we've been out on it quite a few times since that video, and we just we just laugh all day um, at each other, uh, with each other, and for us mentally and our mental well-being, um, I've noticed a big change in my wife as well. Um, you know, it's brought her out of that um, that feeling of just being a prisoner, a prisoner of your own home, as uh, as we all have been, um, and more most. There's, there's, there's more than not got it worse than us. You know, I feel for people that have got no outdoor space at all. You know, they live in a flat. They live where there's just nowhere accessible um, to come to somewhere like this. You know, just to get out into uh, the countryside, bring a bit of fresh air, not be around people, and uh, just release that anxiety from your mind. So that's what we've been doing with the kayak. Uh, I'm still going to do a review on it because uh, it's definitely worth a, a review this car for, for what I paid for it. Um, you do get a lot for your money. Uh, as ever, thank you for uh, clicking on this video and coming on another adventure with us. And uh, obviously when lockdown ends, um, hopefully we get to uh, experience a lot more together. And I can't wait to uh, get a few camping experiences in with that. There's a few rivers I'd like to visit. Um, I need to get a roof rack and put it on the van. This is, uh, yeah, there's a few rivers around the country. I'd like to go do some wild camping. Uh, but as soon as we're unlocked, it's been a long old year. That is for sure. And uh, for me, I just can't wait to get on my bike. So... Tell me, let me know down in the comments below what, what's going to be the first thing that you do when you get let out. You know, what's, what's the first plan? What's the thing that you're, you're, you're drumming up to now? Are you getting your camping gear, your motorcycle ready? Your, whatever it is, your hiking gear, your walking gear, um, your destination. Where are you going? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm genuinely interested. Um, I quite like the interaction. Um, in the comment section with, with people um, and you're quite welcome to, to leave your comment good or bad um, you know whatever you want to say say it down there and I'll get back to you thank you for clicking on this video and um, if you haven't subscribed and hit that uh, notification bell please do so show us some uh, hey buds so yeah there's a lot more Motorcycling videos I want to get back to for the people that subscribe to me for the motorcycling content and obviously um, because of lockdown pretty much drifted into more kayak videos uh, obviously lately um, so like I say um, apart from the review I'm going to do on the kayak um, this is pretty much going to be the last one for a while uh, when it comes to kayaking and uh, until we go camping and uh, that will probably be the next kayaking video to be fair is uh, when we go camping I just want to get out of my bike yeah, just get me out of the bike so uh, please uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so I want to do um, mainly on bike kit so there's a couple I want to do on the Helite Air Vest that I'm just 100% passionate about um, and you know there's, there's a few things I want to do there there's a couple of helmets I still need to review um, but I think because of lockdown I think motorbike wise in my mind has just been put on the back burner and I've been enjoying myself <laughs> not far too much but I've been enjoying myself down <laughs> big brave boy oh yeah yeah as you can see he's security oh yeah look at him go look at him t 
teeth. He's a rock wire. You're a little killer. You're a killer, aren't you? You're a killer. You're a killer. Right. Yeah. But they're not going to hurt you. They're not going to hurt me either. Okay? Are we all chilled now? Are we all chilled now? Come on. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah. Just the way Buddy's had a load of people. He's just scared of the world, bless him. Scared of the world? Look at him. Make him a chihuahua. He should blow us all the way back. I made the, uh, the right decision to um, paddle into the wind um, for the first half of the day. So paddling home, unless the wind changes direction, it's going to be a hell of a lot easier. As ever, thank you very much for following us on our journey. And uh, we'll catch you again on the flip side. Stay safe out there. Mm -hmm.